Hello. Um, this is going to be a bit of a random one today because I have received my new B6 half year. And I also had a little um, delivery for the opening of the shop. So I'll let you guys have a little look at that. But I'm currently in Beck so I'm not very well. So this is why it's going to be a little bit of um, a little bit of an odd one. I've holding my phone with my hand as I record but with me um, B6 I did order these two Tombows as well which I have been eyeing them up for ages but this is my first time trying them out and I really enjoyed using them and ignore the state of my nails oh my Jesus they are a state I've picked them I'm so naughty I tell people off for picking their gel polish off. Don't do it. Leaves damage. It's not nice. <laughs> so I have switched to using more autumn -y stuff. These here are from Sparkles and Charms. I do have the link in my description, I think. And this little... Look, he's so cute. Little cat in a cup. He just screams all of them to me. And then I have got little pumpkins. And this little hanky flower that I've been sporting most of the summer, to be honest. But the tones are quite autumn as well. So, And this little brown kind of my jelly cover. Just got some magnetic clips there. I haven't done nothing to my grey pages yet. I've literally had it like two days. Not not e no, not even two days. Like a day and a half. <laughs> and then I've popped my first little thank you note. This is my shop order that I received. And this is one stack of them here. They're so nice. Oops. And heavy. Hang on. I just wanted to just like any order I receive I just wanted to say thank you so we've got thank you just a little note to show mine and Gump's appreciation for your support we wish you the best adventures so I thought that was quite nice and um, I did draw Gump quite sort of like it can pass for autumn and winter so i got those which i was so happy with them so so happy and then we've got my little harvest mouse that i drew i put bah, i put the acetate down the wrong way though i should have done it the other way and then we have september month so i really not using those tombow pens We've got Autumn shows us how beautiful it is to let things go with a little branch with leaves falling off. Because this is like, I know everybody goes spring cleaning, I do autumn cleaning. That is like when I do a mass declutter ready for Christmas. And then I've just got a little bit of watercolour pumpkins and a bit of florals. A couple of little acorns in there. And same at the top. I did mess up my squares though. I did. I made a boo boo went up. And then we've got month goals. And that is a little sneak peek. Of something coming to the shop. So we've got that. And then we've got my goals here. Which is make sales to save the money. Cozy clutter free home. Which, come on, we all want that, don't we? And I need to lose weight. I do. I need to. And then I watched a video in the... Stalogy... Oh my God, I said it. In the Stalogy Lovers group on Facebook. And she had this idea where on her video she cut down here. And then had her tracker. I thought that was just amazing and then I thought I'm going to put my goals on this side. So we've got week one 
you know, we're starting to return to a bit of a normal life. And then I carry on and I've still got my goals and then I've still got my tracker. It's just daily step towards those goals. So I love it. I absolutely love it. I think she, the lady that I watched, she um, owns the shop in the UK that I bought my Stalogy from. I can't remember her name. I think it's paper therapy. But it was really quick delivery. Really good postage. It, I, it was free postage actually. But it was so fast. It was really, really good. Highly recommend. So then we carry on. And then we're getting into October there. So we've got a little ghosty. And then this is my October monthly spread where I've actually done my boxes correct. If I flip back, can you see that they're quite small there and then they're a nice size here. And then we've just got off autumn leaves and pumpkins, please. Take a moment, step outside and breathe in the cr crisp autumn air. Like that is like my favourite thing to do in autumn. I look like a loon. <laughs> just step outside my door in at night time in my pajamas and robe and just breathe in that fresh air and then we've got some of my own shop stickers in this one so we've got a little gump with his toilet paper where he made himself into a mummy and then we've got the boots they're actually based on my boots that I like have three pairs of the same pair of boots and then we have Gump dressed up as a pumpkin. I thought it'd be cute to like make the little eye holes that would show his face and his patch. And then I quite like octopuses. So we have a little octopus tentacles coming out of the corner. And a little telly because, you know, October, that's movie month, isn't it? And then I've got a lot of birthdays that month. I need to put in another birthday balloon actually. And then we have another corner here. And then we I need to do my um goals for that month. And also in my in the Craft and Hobbit Facebook group, I'll let you all know now. I have designed little mini calendars that I'm gonna use here, but I will also be putting them up in the group as a little monthly freebie on every first of the month so it would definitely be, be worth just joining for that really and you know if you like Gump see what he's up to and then we've got my um my weeks again and my tracker which I did a lot neater that time gotta let the pen dry <laughs> And then that then goes on to the next ones that I have to fill out. And then all of my dailies I have numbered. And then I did put paper clip in here somewhere. Yeah, there. And then from here, all of these are note pages. I didn't think that was too bad. Not bad at all. There's quite a size difference. So he is now going to be my laptop companion, I suppose, for note taking for the shop. And to make sure I'm not. Oh, yeah, and. Those vinyls are coming to the shop too. Love that. And then the rest of in here we have this one that you've seen in my last one. He's still in here. So he has notes in that I need to keep. Which one's this? This is my painting one. 
think this should be the birthday one. Yep, yeah, that is the birthday book. We have Christmas book. My kids are still home. They cannot know. <laughs> These here are from Sparkles and Charms as well. Real nice chunky inserts. The paper she uses is really, really high quality paper. Really nice inserts. And then I cut down my little pencil designs flump book. That was a bit nerve wracking, but he fits. And look what I did this morning. A little gump from the tub. He has already been digital, digitally drawn as well to be made into a sticker. But I love these metallic paints. They're so, so nice. And they make the bubbles nice. Um, the paints are from... Oh, where are they from? A little rainbow moon. That's where the paints are from. I highly recommend if you like handmade watercolour paints, check her shop out. She, um, yeah, there's nothing else in there. She does some really, really beautiful collections. So, that is me for this week. I hope it wasn't too painful to watch with my um, shaky hand. Hope it was all right. And um, when my setup is completed, I will come back and do a proper video with the um, phone holder and nice nails because this is quite embarrassing. <laughs> anyway, I hope you all have a good week next week as your children are returning to school and life is getting back to a bit more normal. And you all stay safe. Thank you for watching. Bye.